What's up YouTube, Wine Rob here. If you like this video and you wanna see more, please like and subscribe. Today's wine drop comes from the Mundo Vino portfolio. They specialize in wines of Spain, Portugal, and South America. Let's travel to Chile's Central Valley and explore two wines from a classic South American winery, Casino Macul, founded in 1865. The vineyards for Casino Macul lie in the outskirts of Santiago, Chile's capital city. Originally imported from Bordeaux, these vines still grow on their original ungrafted rootstock. After almost 165 years, Casino Macul remains the only winery in Chile still in the hands of its original founding family. In case you're not familiar, Chile is on the southwest coast of South America. While the country is over 2,600 miles long, the part we're concerned with lies between 30 and 50 degrees south latitude. All commercial wine growing regions are located between 30 and 50 degrees latitude in both hemispheres. I like to visualize Chile's wine country as a corkscrew. Let's mark Santiago with this star as a reference point, and I'll show you what I mean. To the east, the Andes Mountains create a towering natural boundary, effectively isolating vineyards from outside influence. They provide clean water year-round from melting snow, and the sunny western slopes at lower elevation grow some of the best wines in Chile. To the west lies the vast Pacific Ocean. The Humboldt Current flows north, bringing cold water from Antarctica. The result is a steady stream of cool air and moisture to Chile's western coast. The Val Central, or Central Valley, owes its existence to a low coastal mountain range on Chile's western boundary that isolates and protects this key wine region from the cold Pacific air, creating a warm and sunny pocket where grapevines thrive in a near-perfect environment. The four subregions moving north to south are Maipo, Rapel, Curico, and Maule. A mnemonic trick that makes that easy to remember is Mr. Chili Map. This warm, dry climate and low rainfall mitigate challenges like insects and mildew and explain why the Val Central is home to 80% of all the vineyards in Chile. Our first wine is Chardonnay Antiguas Reservas. The first vintage was in 1969. This wine sees six months aging in new French oak barrels. Barrels are expensive and it's hard to find this kind of quality at this price. In the glass, you get a balanced wine with notes of cream, vanilla, apple, and spice. Our next wine is Cabernet Sauvignon Antiguas Reservas. The first vintage, 1927. That's 93 years ago. In the glass, the winery has made an attempt to keep things consistent through the years. You'll get approachable black fruit and floral notes with an earthy tannic structure that allows this wine to age beautifully as well. Whether they're new to you or you're just rediscovering the wines of Chile, Casino Macul is a terrific place to begin, and these wines deliver a big bang for the buck. That wraps up today's wine drop. Check out Wine Rob on YouTube. More is on the way. If you would like to see more, let me know and please like and subscribe.